Hey everyone, in the news this week, there was an article out about the obesity crisis now costing the UK £98 billion. Pounds. I'm not sure if that's just the cost of the groceries though. Have you seen the price of chocolate lately? Personally, I like to follow the government's advice of always buying food that's locally sourced, by which I mean I buy my microwave meals from the corner shop. The Home Office put out an immigration-themed calendar. Many of its doors arrive wide open and it's seemingly impossible for anyone to close them. And Prince William was in the news selling copies of The Big Issue. I'm guessing it's to raise awareness about homelessness, although they might just be trialling the idea for Harry if he ever tries to come back to live in the UK. The BBC also had an article, quote, Prince William shocks mum in charity walk. I thought his mum was dead. Anyway, it was also the anniversary of Pearl Harbor, where the Japanese attacked the United States back in World War II. Although I've got a Japanese neighbour and the way she drives, I'm wondering if all those planes crashing were just an accident. And finally, the poet Benjamin Zephaniah passed away, so here's a little ditty I scribbled. Benjamin Zephaniah was a poet. He was ill and did not show it. The BBC was sad to know it. They were his biggest defender. Now they need a new contender. To write about left-wing stuff and all its splendour. £100 says a one-show presenter invites on three candidates who are all minorities and transgender. Well, come on, it's better than the walker he used to write in Melvin Bragg's show anyway. Anyway, see you next week. If you like these, click subscribe. Bye.